Hello YouTube, adult fan of LEGO UK here. Welcome to my review of Jabber's Sail Barge. This is set 75020, ages 9 to 14. Comes with 850 pieces and re retails in the UK for £99.99. And That's through the LEGO store or the LEGO store online. Um, I'll put a link down in the description to the unboxing, um, which I've already done for this particular set. So you'll have an overview of the actual box itself, the amount of bags that come inside the box, and um, the instructions and any other accessories that actually came in the box itself. Anyway, so on with this, this review. Um, right, so first of, all, first of all, I think this is a good set. Um, However, I think it is overpriced at £99.99p. Um, 850 pieces doesn't really represent a great um, price per pence or per cent um, value. Um, but it has got some good features on it um, aside from that though. So, right, let's get into the review itself. So, I'm just going to spin around so you can actually see the set from all angles. go okay so let's start with this side here so the first features we have here are to start with these ones you have some little openings here these would be for well cannons really um, you'd have cannons shooting out of there and again on this one again you can see there um, that opens okay I'm gonna have to speed around a lot of these features because there are actually quite a few of them um, side comes down there and that side comes down there so inside now we can see Jabba and Princess Leia um, prisoner so that's the prisoner princess Leia and um, we've got a little prison cell over here so I'm just gonna lift this up bring it in so Hopefully you can see that there. Okay, let's just go back down. Okay, so I'm going to carry on spinning round. These also come down at the rear. Okay. And that we can see here, this is Max Rebo playing his um, drums on the rear of the sail barge there. Okay, carry on spinning around to the other side. So we've got the same features on the other side with these open up like so. So again, that's where your cannons would be um, and firing from. You can see there, close those. Sides come down again on this one, or on this side rather. Okay. I'll talk about the features a bit more in a second. Right, and then also what we can do is the actual entire top. Um, also just lifts off like so. Let's put that to one side. So there we can see the sail barge entirely open. So I'm just going to lift this up. Okay. Bring it into shot over here. Kind of give you... A better look of it. So, like I said, we got Jabba there, Princess Leia, Max Rebo there playing the drums. That spins round. Okay, if I go around to the other side, obviously we can see the rear of Jabba there. We have this is a kitchen area here, so you can see here there's a pot. You see there there are some translucent orange studs down there so it represents a little f um, stove or oven hob area we have a little container here with a printed brick on top and obviously inside here something cooking away here is the sal area that's obviously the rear of it so you can put a minifigure in there there is also a door here which does open Just spin that around to that side so you can see yeah, so that's the prison cell door itself. OK, 
Okay, so that's it for that side. If I just go around here again into the kitchen area, so you can see up here we've got a, um, a chicken drumstick there, a fish hanging up. We have here, hopefully you can see that, there's a frying pan there hanging up. Um, okay, these here, if you can see these there, I will explain what they're for in a minute. So I'm just going to put this back down. So another feature on this is the front area here. So this lifts up. So if we lift this up, and you see there coming out is a cannon itself. So this cannon will come out. And there's the cannon itself. So this does actually fire. There's the firing mechanism there. And the way this works are These are basically the pieces that um, will fire from the cannon. Okay, so that just simply goes into a cannon like so. So that's now in there. So if I put this down here, pull back on the actual cannon piece itself and fire. So a little cool feature there. And that simply goes back into the front, just slot it back in, like so. And then if we shut this down, you'll see that automatically pushes that bit back in. So again, when I lift it up, you'll see it come out, hopefully, to through the front. Yeah, like so. Nice little feature, cool little feature. I think that's it for the main sail barge itself so whilst I've got the roof the top off rather the deck I should say um, just give you obviously the sails here these are like a sort of plastic um, material really good really durable I think they look cool as well you can see there with the pattern on them um, so at the front here we've got well, I'll pronounce his name re re is re is See him now. I'll give you a better look at the minifigures in a second. You can see him standing there, R2D2. And here we've got a skiff guard here. So on the top, there we have a cannon. And that actually has got some flick fire missiles on it. These are flick fire missiles. So I'll just take one out so you can see it. Here is actually a. Here we go, a flick fire missile. So that simply slots into there and obviously it can be flicked out. And again, this will spin round like so. These are adjustable, you can move these, these sails. Now you can put them into different positions. Um, like so, they're actually on a ball joint there. You can see that underneath there. Yeah, that is actually a ball joint, so obviously they can move around um, fairly independently um, of each other. The railing um, obviously goes around the top there, so there we go. I think that's the oh, main overview. I'm just going to put this back together. Okay, and that just simply slots on the top like that. These all <coughs> close round, close, close, close. Very simply like so. There is another feature here. There's a little, you can see there, a cannon here as well. Again, which, let's bring this up. You see that there. Um, and this again can be moved um, around. You can put a minifigure behind that if you want to. We also have this feature here, which come out. So these come out like so on both sides you can see those again they're part of the flying mechanism the sails so they're a combination of sails and can be used as obviously brakes as well if you turn it that way okay so they just quite simply slot back like so 
Okay, that's it, I believe, for the main sail barge. I'll actually just show you there's a lot of stickers on here. So all everything you can see on here basically is a sticker. So we've got stickers all the way along here. They're all stickers, sticker there. Um, and again, same on this side, sticker, 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 stickers along this piece here. And again, same stickers on the rear. <coughs> that actually, that's a printed, <coughs> excuse me, that's a printed piece. Um, which I showed you earlier, so that is a printed piece that's in there. Okay, okay, guys, I'm just going to uh, get all the minifigures off now and I'll give you a quick um, overview of the minifigures. Okay, guys, there we go, review of the minifigures now. So, first off, we do have Max Revo, cool um, little blue minifigure. As you can see here, so he's all this light blue cover color everywhere again he's got the short legs um, his head just take that off okay so this is this what we're getting in more sets now this rubbered textured you see there it's kind of rubber uh, material for his head so I'll just simply slots on there and you can see his printed eyes Okay, that's Max Rebo. Next up we have Reyes. Again, apologies for my pronunciation. Okay, can we see him there? Can we see his print into his front torso and the rear of his torso. Nothing on the legs, comes with this blaster. See his face with his three eyes there. You can see some little the printing on his eyes, black and white pupils. And again, this has got this rubbered texture to it as again for this head. Obviously getting a bit more popular these moulds. Um, next up we have our we have our skiff guard we we so our skiff guard holding his um, spear and axe piece you can see that okay you can see his front torso printing and his rear torso printing with his hair there on the rear of his head going down his back excellent printing to his face on this one let's just move that out of the way really really cool detail on that face and get that in there look at that right. all these tattoos on his face it is a single-sided face apart from obviously the hair great detail um, and obviously his blue arms. Next up we have our R2-D2. So this is kind of our slave R2-D2. Um, or servant. It's obviously been made into the servant for Jabba on his sail barge. So I think most people would have seen R2-D2 many times over. But here he has his tray. Where he's serving obviously Jabba and guests. So he has a glass there. A mug there and a bottle there, which may have wine or water um, inside it. Um, but yeah, that's, um, that's R2D2. Okay, next we have Princess Leia. So this is Princess Leia um, being held prisoner by a Jabba. So again, some really good printing detail. You can see that on the legs and on the front torso. Well, I'll take that off in a minute. So you can see the rear, but you can see a rear. Sorry, the rear of a hair piece and the gold that's actually in her hair there. Uh, front, uh, sorry, her face printing again. Not looking particularly happy. She's got this piece around her neck, which is obviously this chain. We can see here which Jabba keeps hold of. So I'm just going to take a hair piece off. 
as you can see, a double-sided face. 